tradition runs deep in the village of Podilska. At primary school, rehearsals are underway for the national folk dance competition. Among the youngest generations, ambitions are undimmed. This year we competed in national gymnastic competition and I won. Youth is a powerful force in Podilska. In 2015, aged just 24, Artem Kukarenko ran for mayor of the village and won with 80% support. His manifesto was simple, to stop young people leaving. What advice does he have for the next president? He should pay attention to the creation of new jobs. Everyone voices the same concern. The school's Ukrainian language teacher says most of her students leave after graduation. It's quite clear that people want more money, and there is no vision for that in small villages. So that is why quite a lot of young people just go abroad. People are talking a lot about low income and low pensions. We don't have anywhere to work here. All the people have to go somewhere else. 70% of Ukraine's land is given over to agriculture, which generates $18 billion in exports. But Mayor Kukarenko says agro-industrial corporations are swallowing up family farms and jobs. What does the youth need today? A house, a decent job, which provides a decent salary, which may offer them a start. The poor credit system that we've got is a huge burden, not only for the youth, but also for people who are better established. Kukarenko says the high unemployment leads to alcoholism and mental illness among some residents. It seems a bleak future. But for a dose of optimism, head back to school. I don't want to leave Ukraine, but I want to go to another city and then return here to look after my parents and look after my village. I want to go to the most polluted places in Ukraine, to the cities, and work on improving the environmental problems there. Big ambitions for themselves and for their country. But how can rural communities harness and keep their homegrown talent? Ukraine as a country faces huge challenges in the years ahead. For villages like this one, the biggest battle is survival itself. Henry Ridgewell for VOA News, Podilska, Ukraine.